Science. How do plants survive the winter? Unable to migrate to warmer climates, they seem vulnerable to the snow and ice. Yet most of our endemic species deal pretty well with the cold, drawing on their biological and chemical defenses. Some make chemicals that attack ice crystals as they form. Every plant has its own strategy. Very often there are certain substances in the organelles of the cell. It could be sugars or salts. They work like those antifreeze agents you use in the radiator of your car. It means the cells are being protected from freezing to the core. Snowdrops and daffodils are some of the earliest perennials to flower. Although lovely to look at, snow and ice are problematic for gardeners who have plants from a variety of regions in their borders. Those are plants that are not from our region, which come from the Mediterranean, such as rosemary or the fig tree. If they're to winter outside, they must be insulated appropriately. Some plants just cannot stand the cold. Giant cacti, for example, are better off inside, such as here in the Berlin Botanic Garden. And the beautiful flowering camellia also needs a bit of TLC. But prolonged spells of cold can damage even the most hardy perennials and evergreens. When the soil freezes, roots are unable to suck up any water.